Hello everybody and welcome to part 9 of my Final Fantasy 7 Let's Play. And we are back back at Shadenair headquarters here and we are going uh, the stair route. And I'm going to say in particular because I'm getting um well I guess not really spoiling it really. Uh, there is an elixir along the way, and um, it is like about halfway up, uh, you know, going through this uh, section here, and so we're, we're going to go get it. <laughs> That's as simple as that. We're going to go get the useful item there. Um, we're not going through the front because... Because, uh, obviously I wanted to get the, the item there, and I will be coming back down, actually, later to go get the, um, I'll be doing the, um, the Paradise, uh, the Turtle Paradise, uh, flyers there, and I believe there's, like, six or seven in total, and, um, Actually, no, I think about it. I don't recall in this playthrough that I did uh, the first one. At least I don't think so. I might have. But uh, this one here, um, this one is missable, I think. Um, at some point, you won't be able to come back to uh, the Shinra uh, headquarters at all. So it's best to uh, get it while you're here. And, um, just to kind of go what's going on on screen here, um, you know, the crew here are just going up and they're just kind of going back and forth on, well, <laughs> they're kind of joking on how, how long it's taking to get up there and, um, Barrett is having a hard time getting up there and Tifa is kind of having a hard time. There's the elixir. Um... Tifa is kind of having a hard time, but, um, I don't know, she's kind of keeping up, but, I mean, it's video game logic here, you know, everyone's gonna go at the same pace. <laughs> so, what happens is, if, uh, if you're, if you, like, wait for them to go to the top, they won't, like, leave you on the screen, or, yeah, they won't, like, go off of the screen there, they'll, like, wait for you to come up on the top of the stairs, and... Once you get close enough, they'll actually proceed up. So that's kind of neat. So right here, uh, Barrett is just, uh, he's actually just out of, out of, he's kind of beat, I guess. And, uh, Tifa is actually just kind of giving him the, uh, cold shoulder here. <laughs> 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 so anyways <laughs> so we'll be nearing the uh the top f uh floor here we'll actually be getting to i believe it's floor 59 I'm not mistaken. And we actually need to go into the higher tier um, floors there. And we got to get key cards along the way. And this is what I'm talking about. Like, you can beat them up there and you can wait for them if you want. You don't have to, but I know it anyways. But anyways, uh, you're supposed to get uh, card, uh, card keys. And, um, or key cards, yeah. And, uh... And you use them to get up further and further, and at some point you're, you'll you meet up with some people that uh, you have to fight and all that. So we're still going up these stairs here. Uh, as there will be a point to where... Oh, right here. Yeah, this is, uh, this is it right here. When you see this light thing up here, that means it's the end. 
And we're up at the... I guess this is the top uh, of the stairs because it doesn't go any further than this. So... Um, if you go in the front, you, you'll take an elevator and it will just kind of like randomly go to floors and you, you'll eventually get up to right here and you'll just be coming from the north of, of the screen. And you'll fight these guys regardless. Uh, these guys are kind of, I guess, story in a sense because they, after you beat them, you get your first uh, uh, key card. So... So uh, since they're machines, you know, they're, they're weak to lightning, so just use that. And they're really easy. So, yay. <laughs> so we get a card key to get up to the next floor. And we actually, the... Tifa and uh, Bear actually come out like that, and if you, you, it will keep going like that forever until you talk to them. So just uh, go ahead and talk to them, and then it will proceed like that. Whoa! Nineties <laughs> movie magic. So, what's going to happen here is we're going to have to play a little, um, I guess you can call it a mini game, so to speak. Um, those yellow, uh, statues, uh, we got to hide behind them and we got to go in between and get by the guards just like that. And I do this all in one, um, take. Um, if you get caught, you just go back into that room on the left there, and you'll have to start all over again. And you, you can just you can just keep doing it over and over again until you do it, because uh, you get infinite tries. So, right, I'm basically just kind of move when there's no one. Um, you know, no, you know, just like no one there, and it is possible to skip two at a time at some point, but uh, sometimes it's just best to play it safe and just wait until there's no one in the in-between uh, the statues there, and then that way you can proceed. So if you just do it just like I do, you'll do pretty much just fine. And just like that. And there's no uh, key card that you get on this one. Um, you actually are able just to go up uh, the floor there. And on this one right here, you're actually supposed to go down to this uh, southern area here and talk to this guy right here. And you say the dot dot dot. And he'll give you a key card to go up uh, a little bit further. You will think you're uh, like a janitor for some reason. I don't know why. <laughs> or something. I don't know. <laughs> so, next uh, coming up, uh, there's this one right here. It, it's a little strange to how to find out what the password is. The, this mayor has a password, and uh, if you guess it on the first try, he gives you a materia, um, uh, an extra materia. And the way that I'm doing it is I, I went down and uh, back all the way down and saved, and then came back up, and I just figured out what uh, his password is, and then just reset the game and just find out what it is. And then try to, um, you know, that's just how you can cheese it. I mean, it's no big deal. I, I guess you're supposed to read all the, the bookshelves there and figure it out, but it's so stupid. But, uh, so anyways, I'm going to cut past uh, to me, sa uh, me going all the way down and saving, and I'll just cut back to when I get back up here. So, BRB. A few moments later. 
So, funny thing is, is that, uh, I actually guess it, and I actually got it on the first try. I, I was just gonna pick it, and then, whatever, but, uh, I didn't have to, like, reset it, so, there we go. <laughs> I was actually very, very lucky, and the password is random, by the way, so, it's not always the same password each time. And, um, I've never seen any of the other ones. Uh, I've only seen Bomb, King, and Mako, and that's it. I've never seen any of the other ones, um, be the ones. So, I would probably just pick between those three. So we just got us the Elemental Materia, which um, only works with, obviously, Elemental Materia, and it will add the effect to whatever you pair it with. Um, if it's in your weapon, it will add the element into your weapon, and same thing happens if you put it in your armor, and uh, you'll be protected from that uh, element. So if you have um, the element, so let's say with fire in your weapon, you'll have a, a fire weapon. And if you do it in your armor, you'll be protected from fire. So it's kind of like that. So I gave that to, uh, I believe I gave that to Cloud. I wasn't paying attention. <laughs> and uh, so... I gave it to Cloud because he's going to be uh, fighting a little bit later against a boss by himself, so that will be it there. <laughs> So what we're doing here is uh, we're accessing a computer and it will allow us to open three doors. And there's only, like, one way to do this. I don't think there's any other way. So. You're supposed to go up at the top and do this one. And this one. And then you get your first uh, coupon here. And then you go into the, the vent there. And you're, you're not able to do this in reverse because the uh, the vent that we finally go through is actually blocked um, from that direction. So, so we want to go uh, up in this other one over here and this will allow us to get the other two. There's B and then we open our last door and there's C. And then we just go back into the vents and then we just go all the way to the right into that lower right one right there and we're back in the computer room and if you do it just like that you'll be able to get all three of the uh, the coupon stuff there and we will be getting us um, those things there <laughs> and we'll be getting us another all materia and I will actually be putting that on, um, I believe Tifa, and I don't remember who I put it on. Uh, you'll see what I do here. I, I move things around on my material till that, uh, um, so it's more, more better in the long run. Uh, I put the, uh, the star pendant on Cloud. Because he will be, uh, he won't necessarily be in a battle. Uh, that star pendant will prevent, uh, poison, so. That will be useful, uh, for later. So... Uh, this next storm here, I am actually going to be stopping on this floor here. There's a save point, and that will be it for my recording here. Um, as soon as I get all the stuff up here, um, I will be going to the little save point. That's in the lower right there. Um, 
and I will be saving. This is actually the end of, of my first uh, a recording session for this there. So with that, I will catch you guys in the next video there. So be sure to like, comment, and subscribe, and take care, guys.